Hello everyone and welcome back. In this video, I will be showing you how to draw cherries with only four colors. The materials you will need is a pencil, four colored pencils, green, black, white, and red. I'm using Prisma colors, but you can use any colored pencils. You will also need an eraser, a white gel pen, and something circular. First, draw two circles right next to each other. For the guidelines, start by making a dent at the top of the left circle. As they touch the two side lines, go ahead and trace out the circle. Draw a curve at the top and from the middle, start drawing the stem. For the second cherry, the guidelines look something like this. Now define a light area on the bottom as the shadow and also draw different circular shapes for the droplets. At this point, mark the areas for highlights on both the cherries. Now use an eraser to lighten up the guidelines. Then use red to outline the cherry and the droplets. Start by coloring in with black to darken some areas on both cherries. Then use red and color in the remaining of the cherry. Leave out the droplets and the highlights. Now alternate between black and red. This will help build layers and it will be easier to blend with the white. Draw a circle with red on top of both the cherries. Then apply black and red on the shown areas.
Now use white and blend out both the cherries. For the stem, use green to darken up the left line. Then apply black in the shown areas and blend with white. Go over with green once again. Now use black to make the tip of the stems. Time for the droplets. Start by darkening up the top of each droplet, then apply red. For the droplets on the side, use black and only apply it in certain areas. Now use a gel pen and add highlights on every droplet. The last step is to make a shadow. Use black for this. Shade darker beneath the cherries and farther as you go away. And this is how you draw cherries. I hope you learned something from this video and if you enjoyed it, please like, comment, share, and don't forget to subscribe.